my last rotation in medical school, I actually did an OBGYN rotation and absolutely fell in love with it. I enjoyed the relationships between the women and their physicians and um, the moments that everybody, you know, you're part of experiencing. Um, and also I enjoy the fact that there are very few specialties that you are involved with every woman and that's OBGYN. At some point in their life every woman will need either obstetrical or gynecological care and I really enjoy that. You know, we may not need, you know, a rheumatologist or a cardiologist, but you'll always need an OBGYN. So I really like that aspect of it. My favorite health tip for patients is to be an advocate for yourself um, and don't postpone your care um, or your health, for instance. I know a lot of patients who are busy, professional women, busy at work or caring for their children and we tend to postpone our health and put things off until the very end um, when in fact it's, it's something that could have changed quality of life and made it a lot better for them. When I meet a new patient for the first time, I like to essentially have a conversation. Um, there are a lot, most women, we all have similarities, we all go through similar experiences and I think finding that experience is um, a good base for building uh, a good rapport with a patient. Find a physician that you feel comfortable with, I think first and foremost. To obstetrical care, gynecological care, it's, it's a very intimate profession and you want to be completely comfortable with the person that you are going to hopefully be seeing for years to come who will care for you when you are having children who will care for you after you have children going through menopause changes of life and so um, i think having someone that you're comfortable with and that you work well together and who listens to you is, is very important